Giannis Antetokounmpo sitting out for the first time this season with quad soreness. Bucks come in against the New Orleans Pelicans, having won 15 straight. Now, the Bucks won 15 games all of Giannis's rookie year, so they have certainly come a long way. And when Giannis is out, the others must step up. Chris Middleton had 24, two off a season high. Ursan Ilyasova, 18 points and nine. Nine rebounds in a starting role. How about Eric Bledsoe with the crossover in for the lay-in? We'll take another look. Bledsoe blowing right by Drew Holiday. Alvin Gentry, Pelicans coach, looking rather solemn. You would too if you had lost nine straight coming into this one. Milwaukee led by 23 at halftime, and Bledsoe asserting himself even more in the second half. He was 10 of 13 from the Floor, a team high 29 points for him and then more from Middleton tough jumper right there off the window is good Bucks basketball battle tested Giannis approved 127 112 16 wins in a row longest streak for the Bucks Oklahoma City winners of three in a row in Sacramento to take on the Kings who have won two straight Marvin Bagley injured his thumb on opening night missed 22 games but he's back in action on Wednesday, and the Kings trying to get him involved early as he goes to work in the post. Dennis Schroeder, during this three-game winning streak for the Thunder, has averaged over 24 a game, and here on Wednesday, he ends up with 17 points to lead. The Thunder, they were up by nine at halftime. Off the miss here in the third, Bagley there for the putback dunk. 11 points, six rebounds, and a block in 23 minutes off the bench. Then Buddy Heald getting involved. Knocking down three balls from the top of the key. Left wing gives Sacramento a one-point lead. He had 23, including five triples. Bogdan Bogdanovich knocking it down right there with 13 ticks on the clock. You remember on Monday, Nemanja Bielica beat Houston at the buzzer with a shot similar to that. And now the Kings have a one-point lead. Chris Paul for the win. And it rattles off the rim. And the Kings, in dramatic fashion for a second straight game, come up with a victory 94-93 at home. Carl Anthony Towns and the Timberwolves trying to stop a five-game losing streak taking on Rudy Gobert and the Jazz. Early on, Donovan Mitchell into the lane, going up. Oh, and he's still going up. Donovan Mitchell throws it down. On the outside, Joe Ingles steps into a three. He had 23 in the game. Jeff T, unstoppable in the first half. 22 in the first half, would finish with 32. Look at him step back on Gobert and knock down the three. Tied at 59 at the half third quarter it's Towns into the lane all but tackled and still scores Towns had a double double 21 and 11 but Utah runs away Gobert 20 points 16 rebounds and then there's Donovan Mitchell scoops it up and in two of his 30 and Utah wins this one, 127.